embarrassment and fear look very similar in the brain when it gets going. And so you know what it's like when you're embarrassed in front of a group of people, how you can't think and you just want to get out of there and you're, you can't process. That is something we don't want to do to our kids in the classroom. And if we're speaking loud when we're talking to them and other kids are listening to the correction that we might be doing, that's going to be embarrassing and make it much harder to coach the kid through it. Getting them to settle down and to listen to us is a skill. And you can help them do that by speaking more softly because if they have to focus and listen, it will actually help them regulate quicker. I always say pat yourself on the back when you're using some of these skills and a kid says to you, I really can't hear you. Just know you're doing well and then you get a great line to say next. You say, well, I don't want people listening. I want to be respectful. So let's move away over here so I can talk a little louder and you can hear me better.